I'm Rizani Mazani and I'm playing Zo. I'm Benjamin Chow and I play Benmin. So what happens is that there's a video that gets released on Facebook and it creates a ruckus. And on this video, there's an old lady who's a waitress screaming at this gay couple and their child, right, whom they've adopted. And she's calling them horrible things, you're perverts, you're, you know, horrible human, pe uh, human beings. And that woman is my aunt, my character's aunt. I think for Zoe, it represents the group of people who are prejudice against the, 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 the homosexuals. So he's, he, he, he takes that from the video and he uses that as the impetus for the whole show. And my character reacts to this uh, 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 in a way which is very exciting because he's gay and has never identified as gay, has never come out as gay. I think that tango is incredibly crucial, especially now you know, in our uh, current global landscape. The dialogue that it's furthering is so much more than just about LGBT issues. It's about family, it's about what it means to live here in Singapore, it's about culture, it's about language differences, it's about that barrier, it's about generational gaps. I love the play because it's nuanced and it's delicious that way. It's so much more than just about LGBT. I think if we just kind of take all the labels out, it is about we as human beings behave as a unit in a community, in a society, and in a country. I hope that whoever comes to see the show will have their sympathies challenged. Whatever their original root sympathies, wherever they might lie, with whatever camp or side, yeah, hopefully this play challenges it.